could you ever see, like, just wake up one morning and you say, "Hun, that's it." I mean, I, there would have to be an event. I mean, something that. that but does would, somebody would cause have to that. tell you, you wake up. to that that you're done, or will you know when you're done? <laughs> I think I'll know. I think I will know. What would tell you you're done? Uh, when you don't enjoy the training process or the preparation anymore. And that's what I always wanted to know. If I'm looking at a quarterback, I want to know how much you love the game, how much you want to be great. Yeah, yeah. How much, like, the, you got to be diving in to be a student. And that was the difference between Ryan Leaf and Peyton Manning, in my opinion. They both had the physical talent. Yeah. Peyton just ate up the game. He absorbed yeah. it. Yeah. And, and I don't know how you can figure that out. If I'm looking at Deshaun Watson, I know he carved up Alabama. I don't know how I can find out if he really loves the game and wants to be great. Can you find that out before you draft somebody? I think you can. I think you can by by talking to those you know closest to him that observe him on a daily basis, um, because t to your point, what makes the player great is not the physical attributes. Um, it's it's the fire that burns within. It's that competitive nature. It's the chip on the shoulder. It's the something to prove, and it's having a purpose, like having a great like it. To 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 kind of elaborate on what I said earlier about what, why I feel or when I feel like it'll be time is as long as I feel like I have a purpose for playing like and I have a challenge to be met a goal to strive for then then there's a passion to play the game without that uh, I don't I don't think I don't think it's uh, you know could you, have, anymore. could you ever see a scenario where you don't finish your career in New Orleans I don't would I don't. you would you retire if would you quit if there was any possibility that you know, they were going to no, say. No, I mean, if the Saints came to me right now and said, hey, you're, you're not our guy anymore, we're releasing you, I'd be like, nah, I, I still got football left in me, so I'm going to Oh, I'm you'd go play. play someplace. Yeah, I'd go play if they let me go right now. <laughs> but, but uh, no, I mean. Paulie, would you check and see if the Saints still want. <laughs> I, just don't, I just don't, I just don't, I don't ever, I don't ever desire to go anywhere else and, and, and play for any other team. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.